Dynamic learning is what you'll discover in Heather Thornton's Gulf Coast High School science class. Flipping the standard science experiment on its head is her magic formula and is a great example of her best practice, which is promoting active learning through student engagement. And then we're going to feed this bacteria to C. elegans, which is our worm. It's going to be, it's a roundworm, a nematode, and this is in order to induce RNAi interference in the roundworm. Well, actually, I thought of all the things that I've created through my teaching, and I tried to find the common element. And I figured out that the common element is getting students actively involved in their own learning process. And so having student design labs and study documentation, which is another element of my practice, students actively get engaged in their own process. They learn how to study um, in a way that's best for them, They're, and we go through the process of figuring out what learning style is best for them, and then they progress as students and become lifelong learners. Well, Mrs. Thornton has been able to shape the mindsets of everyone in her classes to become more interested in studying and ensuring that they could have the potential to be, make an impact in the future. I hope to study biomolecular science and eventually enter the career of immunology. You know, I, I can't say that any of my two kids, um, I would have imagined that they'd ever like the sciences, but I think the reason they both have gone into AP science courses is basically because she didn't scare them off. She made it understandable, she made it teachable, she made it um, so they could understand at whatever level they were. Heather has ignited student engagement by creating an environment for critical thinking, improved problem solving skills, and real world science experiences. By designing and implementing study documentation, the students show they understand complex scientific concepts and provide supporting evidence. I think it's very important that we recognize our teachers of today. Um, they are inspiring our children to go on to become the leaders of tomorrow. Um, I want my child to have every opportunity to explore every possibility. Within today's society, it is of utmost importance that teachers are being represented and being thanked for what they do because they truly are the unsung heroes of today's society. Like a doctor might save a life, but a teacher can change a life. So what teachers do for our society today, it's truly impacting. We're talking about ethics. We're talking about things that matter to the students and that they actually go out into the world, talk to their families, talk to their parents. I've had students actually say to me, um, I, I ended up using what we learned in genetics in a debate. I used it in an essay I wrote yesterday. I used it in a model United Nations uh, competition. And so it's infiltrated their lives and it's gone out into the community through them, which I think is really cool. By encouraging her students to experiment with various study techniques, she's teaching them which methods best fit their learning style, ensuring a future path for individual development and success. My students inspire me. Their curiosity inspires me. I change my lessons on a daily basis based on their curiosity, their interest, uh, their motivation in learning, and I'm very creative in what I do. Everything that I do is my own. And so I like to tweak things um, so that students have that aha moment. I think that really inspires me, that aha moment when I'm explaining or showing visuals and doing multiple modalities and the students actually go, oh, I get it. So, and then they explain it. And then the other students go, oh yeah, now I get it.